Continuing our ongoing pursuit of education, Turtle with Lemonade Productions proudly presents Little Known Moments in American History. In this expedition, I shall capture a beast that no man has captured before. Legendary tales are told of the American Sasquatch. Yet, recognition of this beast has not yet been recorded in nature books or any other respectable literature. I, Theodore Roosevelt, shall do what other men have only attempted. I shall find the great beast and bring it to its knees. I have no fear of the beast, yet I respect the difficulties of this task. I have shot a rhinoceros at 13 paces. I have shot several different species of bear, and I have wrestled a lion mm, with my bare hands. And though each of these animals have their own set of challenges, the Sasquatch is more cunning than all of them. I shall have to be at the very top of my form. Fortunately, I am. When I shoot the beast, I shall cut off its head like a where is my sword? Ah, nature. This certainly is a fantastic spectacle. The beauty that this country possesses should be preserved for all generations. This certainly is a picturesque, oh, bully. There's one now. Why, this poor soul has died of yellow fever. That was the record maker. You shot the record maker. Why, that is chicanery and an assault on my character. I shall not stand for this flippancy. I challenge you to a boxing match. A boxing match? No. We will be boxing one way or another. If you choose not to participate, it shall only make it easier for me. What? You're insane. Oh, God. This will be the final segment of our adventure. It seems my compatriots have fallen to the likes of yellow fever and a severe head bludgeoning that I assume was given by the great beast. He was more elusive than I had prepared for. And though he has won this round, I shall return and claim his hide in the near future. Farewell. This has been an installment of Little Known Moments in American History.